We are going to a burn a boy concert. I've been spending all day getting ready, went to the salon, had many and petty. I now been in the shower for like an hour. I'm now putting on a face mask. I'm gonna be blow drying my hair, doing my makeup, pre-drinking with you guys. So basically my friends are coming over at six. It is now almost four o'clock. So I have two hours to blow dry my hair, do my makeup, and then we're gonna be making cocktails here. And then at around eight o'clock, we're heading to the concert. Put on a Dermalogica multivitamin power recovery mask. Got a test of it, it's really good. So I put that on, I'm gonna let it be for like 10 minutes. While I'm doing that, let me go over the apartment because my friends are coming over, so it needs to be clean. I don't know which album he's gonna sing tonight, but girl, I love all the songs, okay? And this is like the best part of getting ready. It's like blow drying your hair. I'm gonna be putting in some Olaplex. Number seven. I think like that's enough. Need some heat protector because we're gonna be putting lots of heat on our hair today. Is this heat protector? Yeah. <laughs> Imagine if I like spray oil or something on. Ew. It's exactly 5 30 so my friends are here in 30 minutes i feel a little bit stressed because i need to do all my makeup and then i wanted to fix like a cheese board thing is worse than doing your makeup in a hurry i love taking my time when it comes to my makeup like just relaxing you know doing it slow taking my time making sure everything looks perfect and flawless stressing for me is like the worst thing because i forget to breathe first of all like literally forget to breathe but also it's just my makeup doesn't turn out the best and i'm gonna go with something that i know is gonna look good which lashes do we go for see i started wearing lashes now that i do my makeup i don't go without lashes i'm obsessed but like which one do we go for so this one is a little bit more fluffy i think a bit shorter as well so more fluffy and short this one is longer and more wispy i feel like this one might go better with the makeup. Mm. Wow, so fresh. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm using this one from Milk. It's really good actually. Um, it makes your skin dewy and also it makes your makeup last very long. Oh, yeah. Oops, there they are. Hi. <laughs> It's lit. <laughs> We're in the process of making cocktails. The concert starts in one hour, and here we are making cocktails. Making cocktails and content. This is M, you guys. Look at her. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. You are look so nice in your pies. Thanks. Oi, oi, oi. Champagne. <laughs> A hole in the mouth, isn't it? Mm -hmm. I don't want to see him. I just want to see him. I want to get all. Exactly. Does this guy even know them? Si fito o gyal dem. Oi, oi, oi! Look at that big body. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I just DM Burna Boy asking if I can bring my vlogging camera. Hopefully, he's gonna reply though. <laughs> Uber is here. Let's see if he has an aux cord. That's gonna decide the mode of the night. Our Uber is so lit, guys! Can I just say that Uber was so lit? Oh, 
Because that was moving that was good. Then here they have like a photo. We had such a fun time. I ended up just going home after the concert. I've worked today. I'm gonna be filming a little bit. And then at three, we are going for a hair appointment because you know, going to Dubai, I cannot look like this, you guys. My hair is a mess. It's gone super dark and just disgusting. So I'm actually planning on going a bit lighter today and maybe cutting a little bit of it off. And then we have a lash lift appointment at five. The skies are blue today. Let me show you guys. Like how exciting is this? I love. I just did like a super light and natural makeup. I did nothing on the eyes because I'm gonna be having to take it off anyway at the brow and lash appointment. This part of the video is in paid collaboration with Gymshark is having their Black Friday sale on the 18th of November at 8 p.m. Central European time. I'm gonna show you all the pieces. They're all up to 70% off. However, make sure to check your local store for the exact prices as they can vary. Don't forget to check the description box where I will have the direct link as well as all the pieces and colors and sizes I'm wearing. This is the first outfit you will be able to find on the Black Friday sale on Gymshark. Flex crop top and flex low rise leggings. I love these leggings. Guys. Guys, it's really making my body snatched like just look at that booty oh my god like the shading the highlighting this is what it looks like from the back our next outfit is first off these flex shorts I have these in different colors but I've never tried this one and I'm insanely in love with it I think this light pink just goes so nice with my tan to go with it I'm wearing this vital seamless long sleeve zip up I'm in love with this top you guys look at how clean it looks like I will literally wear this out i love wearing long sleeves to the gym as sometimes i just don't feel like doing legs and upper body so i feel like this piece is great in my collection because i really do need some more long sleeves this is the next outfit that can be found on the gymshark black friday sale i'm wearing these bright pink shorts that are so comfortable they can also be found in different colors and then this kind of off-white long sleeve top i really love this outfit because of how comfortable and loose fitting it is i would love to like run in this because Getting sweaty in something like this would be super comfortable. Can we take a second for this new Apex seamless crop top from Gymshark? I'm obsessed with the style of it. It's super flattering for the woman's body. I'm wearing it together with the seamless energy shorts in the color Rich Mocha. I am obsessed. Look at that, you guys. So flattering. And then in the back, it's got a cutout. I'm not wearing a bra with it. And look at this support. Like, just look at that gonna be the last outfit i will be showing you guys i'm wearing these energy seamless blue shorts i'm obsessed with this color it's so vibrant and then i'm just wearing this loose fitting top so if you babes are looking for some new gym wear do not forget to shop on the gymshark black friday sale it's the best time honestly to spend some coins and save some coins as well i now need to hop into my outfit and go to my hair appointment it's in 30 minutes i lost track of time while i was filming my gymshark lab and i now need to rush to the bus because it's coming in five minutes and i also didn't eat anything and i'm gonna be at my hair appointment for an hour or two and then lash lift i'm gonna be starving anyway i grabbed this on the way and a banana so hopefully i'll be able to like buy lunch somewhere but we will get glam today i'm excited my hair has just been disgusting for too long now. I was sitting up all night looking at pictures for inspiration and I found this one. I'm obviously not going to be able to go this light. It just wouldn't look right on me. But I think it looks insane on her. Especially like the 70s style hair like Matilda Dior is like my hair inspiration so but because I'm so dark naturally after a couple of months it would just not look great so I'm gonna ask my hairdresser what she thinks but we're absolutely going a bit lighter anyway um, also I will put her Instagram down below because I know people ask me all the time Dana where do you go where do you get your highlights this is the place I go it's in central Stockholm so yeah guys I will catch up with you as soon as we get there
det jag nämnt. Tack. Yesterday when I got back from my appointments, I forgot to show you guys the result. This is the hair. I don't know if it looks very different on camera, but in real life, it looks lighter overall. I went in with some highlights and I also cut it a quite a bit because the styling I do nowadays with a blowout, it just looks the best when my hair is like a bit shorter because that way it gets really bouncy. And then look at that brow lift, guys. As usual, I'll put all the places I go down below in the description. On today's schedule, we need to go and bring out a parcel. Let's see what I need to do more. So I need to bring out a parcel. I'm gonna be vlogging. I want to cook something today. I want to do like something healthy because I've started to eat healthy. Found the sickest recipe, you guys. Just look at this. I need to make this. It is like a shrimp burrito bowl. It's got rice, shrimps, avocado, lime, corn, and tomatoes in it. So I'm just buying all the recipes right now. It actually is a lot of stuff, but I'm just craving it. It's super healthy. So I'm going to try to make it this. Not me spending a millions on ingredients for my burrito bowl, but not buying a plastic bag. Guys, the plastic bags in Sweden are so expensive at the moment because they don't want people to buy them and use them because it's bad for the environment, but... I can literally buy so much food and I will still not just buy a plastic bag. I ordered three men's oversized t-shirts. So this one is like a dark blue one with pink details and this is the back. Wait, hold on. Maybe I ordered it in a size too big. This is large. I was going for that oversized look, but it's a men's t-shirt. So maybe it is too big. Let me try it on quickly, you guys. So I think this is, well, maybe it's not too big. What do you guys think? Is it too big? I mean, I do like the oversized look. So I was thinking you can tuck it into like your bra and then wear it with a skirt. Mm, scenario, I can just give it to Philip. I'm sure he will love it. This one is pink. And then also I can just wear these in the house if I don't. I do not like the material of this one. I don't know how to explain it, but it's super thick. It's not like these thin ones. This is super thick. And I usually it's better quality, but I just don't like how it feels. So this is the pink one, also very big. This is the last t-shirt, it's black. I mean, I can also just wear these lounging in the, I like this one. This is the black t-shirt. Just so you guys could help me. I think I really like this one actually. Like the size is perfect. It's not like too big. And here is the pink one. I don't like this. I think the color is too much. The size is weird. I don't like the material. So this one is probably for return if I don't end up just wearing it in the house. But I don't think because I have so many other things to just wear in the house. I'm going to start cooking my shrimp burrito bowl. I just peeled off all the parts of the shrimp that I, apparently I couldn't eat. And I'm so sorry, but why did no one tell me this is how much shrimp I'll have left after peeling all that? I'm so disappointed. I'm sorry, but who's going to eat this? Burn the cat. I'll probably get a million comments saying I did everything wrong. <laughs> Even though I did so much research and I really did my best. Let's compare it. So that is the photo. And then that's my food. I mean, the only thing that's different is they have a sauce on top of it and their shrimps are bigger. But you guys, look at it. Is this gonna be my new addiction? I'm sorry. Oh my God. It's so fresh. Oh my God. Mm. Guys, highly recommend. It's so bomb. Also really healthy. <laughs> Citron, 
been one hour since I had that burrito bowl and I've just been laying in the sofa trying to fool myself that I'm not craving something sweet but you guys I cannot like you don't get it I'm so craving something sweet so I just started googling and I found this recipe of a healthy option for muffins so you need two eggs two bananas some baking powder some blueberries I only had one egg so I just did one egg one banana it's very little but I think it's gonna satisfy my sweet craving should we just add like a whole bunch of blueberries I'll put this in the oven for seven to nine minutes and honestly just hope for the best it's been 10 minutes in the oven and this is now what it looks like I already tried a little bit because I couldn't wait but wow about to eat my healthy muff what the fuck is that what the fuck wait 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 hold on you guys what the fuck is that and I can't feel anything it didn't even taste anything. <laughs> that is something else. Mm. One banana, one egg, half teaspoon of baking powder, blueberries in the oven for 10 minutes on 250 degrees. We were just out for breakfast. Philip went to work and I'm now doing my makeup. It is around one o'clock, I think. Um, I'm gonna be meeting up with my friend Matilda. It's been a while, so we're just gonna hang out, go central, do browsing. You know what girls do, basically. Today's gonna be last day of this weekly vlog. And then um, the rest of these days we're in this apartment. I'm gonna focus on packing my stuff because we are moving out on Saturday. And as everything's looking a bit unclear with Dubai, we still haven't found an apartment there. Um, I don't exactly know what's gonna be happening these coming weeks. So I'm gonna put weekly vlogs on hold for a little bit until we figure life out. I find that I have a hard time doing my work, which is social media and balancing that out with just real life, especially being in this weird state where like we're moving a lot and i don't know if it's normal in this age to move around as much as me and philip do but i'm honestly so tired of it as well trust me me and philip spoke about it the other day we're both just really tired of it and it's all because we have both been wanting to be in dubai but dubai has just not been really working out for us so we're hoping it's gonna like because we both really want to just settle down somewhere and not you know move around so much guys we've been living in maybe like five different apartments just this year it's too much stress and it's like i can never like even buy a coffee machine and feel like you know i can keep it because i'm always worrying about moving somewhere else so oh, i just want to figure that part of my life out for a moment and then we can continue doing videos because I also hate putting up videos knowing I'm not 100% happy with it. It just it stresses me so much. I love having good content and being happy with what I do. And right now I'm just not there. I'm thinking about styling my hair because it's gone really frizzy. Let's do a couple big loose curls just to get some shape back. I keep getting this question, Dana, how's your hair so healthy? It's not. It's really not. It's breaking off. That's why I cut it so much this time because I was like, oh my god, like I can't be bothered having unhealthy hair anymore. I'd rather have short, healthy hair than long, disgustingly dry hair, guys. That's just me. And I know I should have gone shorter than this, but I also don't really suit short hair. <sighs> what am I doing? okay this is my ootd i just kept this gymshark long sleeve on and then threw on these cargo pants from plt and then my sneakers are 
Gucci. I don't know which coat to wear though because all the coats I have um, are usually like nicer coats because I don't wear this kind of coats anymore. This is like very street. really loved how my hair turned out though. I'm really happy with it. So love that. I'm going to throw on a jacket now. Pack my bag. Pack my bag. You guys know like my lipstick, cards, keys, all that. And then we're headed off to go central and hopefully we can take some pictures before sun goes down because it's already looking like it's gonna go down it's super gloomy as well but yeah see you in central oh my god why are my teeth so white i can't stop thinking about the fact whether i shut down my curling iron and i was sitting on the bus stressed as fuck trying to watch the vlog where i'm showing you guys the outfit and trying to see if the switch is on or off and it's stressing me a lot right now I can't really just enjoy myself because I'm like, what if it's on? Anyway, I'm now waiting for Matilda um, I might just grab like a cup of coffee before she comes and then we're gonna start shooting I might just go home very early today because I can't stop thinking about the curling iron Let's see if we can grab coffee here This place is called Grand Cafe So I suppose they should have cafe coffee got two cappuccinos one for me and one for matilda i'm sitting here waiting for her noticing people are already ice skating you guys what a vibe it's giving me mad christmas vibes look should we do it let's try this coffee i've never had coffee here before It's called Grand Cafe. It's in Kungstregården in Stockholm. It looks really cozy. Maybe we can take pictures here actually. But coffee was nice and they had so many nice pastries. But you guys know I'm not eating sugar. trying to take photos for like 20 minutes now or actually Matilda hello guys has been trying to take photos of me yeah. for 20 minutes her hands kept getting so cold yeah, they're and like red. Red. they're red at this point look what the fuck is this <laughs> <laughs> it's so cold it's like I swear zero degrees right now and it's super gloomy so I didn't like any of the photos so we're just not gonna do it anymore no we're gonna go to Zara instead yeah. have a browse there I think that's better. Yeah, and like she's gonna buy a coat because hers is too cold. I'm so cold right now. Yeah. And this is ice latte at this point, guys. And people yeah. are staring, so I'm gonna stop vlogging, okay? <laughs> we are in Zara now, and what do we think of this hat? It's kind of given me a moment, but at the same time. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Matilda, stop. <laughs> Why is it so big? Excuse me. <laughs> well, you look cute though. It's kind of cute. It's kind it of giving me a moment, right? So I was just like a bit shocked, <laughs> but yeah. In the fitting room, and is this outfit not giving? Just look at these pants. A vibe. Look at this bodysuit. A vibe. And this hat. I thought it was a joke, but it's not a joke anymore. I keep wearing it throughout the store, and I love it. Having a burger as usual, but this is like a healthy alternative. It's made out of eggs and chicken. And then Matilda had healthy pancakes. You told me you don't like burgers that much. Yeah, you? I like, don't. What the hell? I don't know why. I just think it's basic. I don't know why. <laughs> Guys, should we cancel her? <laughs> oh my god. Mm. Oh, that's a yummy cookie. Bro, you want to taste it? You have to taste it. You have to. You have to. Bro, I'm like, it's so bomb. You need to try the pancakes. I do though. Was it Nutella? No. Okay. So this is like healthy Nutella. Yeah. No. No. Healthy pancakes. Yeah. Cheers. Hey, do I? Stop crashing. I'm coming to my 
<laughs> I went into the grocery store and I bought some ingredients to make tacos. Philip is coming home soon. We're going to be watching Disney and eating tacos. But I won't be vlogging anymore today because I feel like I have enough material. So I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. If you did, please subscribe to the channel and on my IG. And then I will see you guys in my next video. Take care. I love you so much. Bye.